Hello you, welcome to Geekism. Slight issue, we have a uh, forest fire. I'm pretty sure I turned disasters off. In fact, I'm sure I turned disasters off. Um, for some reason, we're getting a fire fire, a fire, 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 fire. Let's have a look. Uh, graphics, no, where is it? Gameplay. Um, random disaster frequency, none. Use random disasters isn't even turned on. Hmm. Maybe it's just one of them things. Maybe maybe the random disasters are like the whirlwinds and things like that, and this is just something that happens. But we have a, you know, firefighters are, seem to be doing a pretty decent job. Um, you know, hopefully it won't affect it too much. What I really don't want you to do is get over to here where we've placed loads of stuff. Uh, if anyone knows a mod to stop this happening, that would be great. You know, I don't mind, you know, slight issues, but this is like taking a huge chunk out of our, uh, out of our area, you know? Anyway, other than that, we're doing pretty well. All our uh, demands are pretty level uh, and our tourist area has filled out quite nicely I'm gonna do a, uh, a bit of work over here to start off with uh, in this area I think I've got some parks made up that look like cargo ships so we're gonna look cargo areas so I'm gonna have a look at those first see what they look like um, in fact let's just have a little search for cargo and see what we've got um, cargo yard yeah see there's these that are quite cool uh, cargo prop thingy yet yeah. uh, that's oh is that the one we've actually put down cargo train terminal yeah that's the one we put down um, there's a few other those not open yet these are just individual cargo trucks and things what are you your Kansas City Freighter says there's a holding area for cargo that's delivered by rail Ooh, that might be nice so that is I guess like an old thing that that uh that they don't use anymore I guess hmm and what are you? You're the sea and skyscraper. Uh, oh, we need to do something to get you. Okay, cool. Well, no, these are the, this is the sort of thing I was looking for. This looks cool. Um, I I, I, do you class as a park? Let's have a look. Do you need something to stay where you are? Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, yeah. So you need... What are you? Oh, where have I gone? Uh, blue. Does that mean you need... Excuse me. Does that mean you need industrial? Let me just try that. Because if it does, we need to maybe look at doing it another way. Let's see what that does when we build it out. No, they're going away. Maybe, is it commercial then you need? Um, do some zoning. Here, commercial. There we go. And then put you down because you're blue, I guess. That's what I'm thinking. No. Where do we get that to stay then? Oh, residential that I was doing. Yeah, I bet, it's, I bet it's this then. Let's have a look. Let's try once more. Third time is a charm. There we go. This looks better. And yeah, you're going to stay. Okay, cool. Do you actually provide jobs? Uh, oh, you do. Industry building. Um, okay, cool. Well, I didn't necessarily want you to. It was going to be mostly uh, looks-wise, this was. But that's okay. I can work with that. Um, what I really want... Yeah, I didn't really want to do that. Let's, let's just move you a little. Let's move you right up to here, then. Make you a thing. You should stay when I use move it, I think. Yeah. Okay, cool. So let's uh, let's get rid of these trees. Oops. Okay. And let's pave this area. Um, not quite that big. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. You don't you don't stay unless you're on the thing. Never mind. Um, let's pave you. Oh, but not the. Oh, do we want the track paved? Actually, yeah, that looks pretty neat. Uh, might have to do a bit of work to knee it up afterwards. But actually, yeah, that's kind of uh, that's kind of a good look. Okay, let's put you. Let's do. Oh, I mean, all of this really needs to be what we're doing here. Um, let's do a bit of work. What's this? Go away. Um, we need to get rid of you. This is all good because I, I don't. I just want this to be aesthetic. I don't want this to be a usable area because I think it's just a bit too far out. Uh, we'll we'll tidy up that area in a minute. But what I was hoping for really was like was more sort of like 
random cargo stuff. So um, let's have a look. Is there, is there a crane? Yeah, this is the kind of thing I was looking for. So industrial crane, do you sit over the top of something? Yes, there we go. This is really the sort of thing I was looking for. Uh, we need to turn prop anarchy on for this. Shift P. Uh, okay, so let's, uh, let's have a look. Let's put you down. Even though this is actually the straight through one, this is where the, the, the trains are going to go. Whoops. Straight through. This is actually the sort of thing I was looking to do. Cool. And then what else have we got? Oh, look at that one. Do you go on top of you, do you? What are you, what are you called? Mobile. Oh no, your little your little car one. Crane rail. Ah, I see. Now you're a static thing. Is it you that needs the crane rail? Yeah. So even though this is a construction crane, I still think it'd look quite neat here for dragging things around. So I'm going to put one here and one. Oops. Um, over on this side as well, I think, in the middle here. Yeah, yeah, you look really neat. What are you? You're a mobile one. Okay, cool. So really, it's these, it's these things we need. Um, cargo. Yeah. What are you? Small shed. Oh, let's have some small sheds. Um. Let's have a small shed on here, so it looks like that's where you would go to, to get into it. Yeah. And then we want some of these. Like so. There we go. And let's just try industri oops, industrial, see what that gives us. Ah, look. Cargo yard, we don't want to use that. Or crusher. I would say these are all, yeah, we've got to be careful we don't actually put buildings down because I don't really want them doing stuff. Looks like these are mostly going to be built. Oh, you're, you're pretty neat. Rusty warehouse, 4x4, global generic industry. Yeah, I don't really want to start, I don't want to give, give bleh, I don't want them giving off stuff. Ah, here we go, prop. Yeah, this is more like it. Okay, cool. Um... What are you? You look ace. You're an industrial conveyor. Oh, I like it. Let's get an industrial conveyor. Where should we get that? Let's have that coming down off of the... Uh, off of this. If we can. Okay, that's not quite right. Um, let's just move, move it if we can. Where are you? Hoping it's you. No, not you. There we go. Yeah, that's it. You want it so it looks like it's just coming out. I mean, it's coming through those pipes, isn't it? Let's see if we can get it somewhere else then. Um, I mean, it could kind of come out of that, although that's probably not accurate. It looks cool, so we're going for it. Okay, what are you? Random industrial prop. Oh, wow, okay. Here we go. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. NASCAR? No, I don't want NASCARs. Okay, so we want some of these old dirty tanks somewhere. Let's have you here. Um, like so. And one of you next to it. Okay, good. And what are you? Are you just a pylon? Oh yeah, you're no good. Well, you are, but we don't want you. Roof platform. No. Uh, a couple of these ones over here. together I mean the, the, the heights all over the place on this build area unfortunately and um, vertical tanks these look neat let's have a few of them in a row oh you do different colors as well that's cool NASCAR we're really not interested in this whole area really needs to be gated so let's put a couple of gates in we'll have one here um, and then and then with these things, I mean, really, I'm hoping these change as you move them, I guess, do they? Let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. Because with these need to be, there needs to be so many of them, it's, it's going to get ridiculous. So let me get to move it and select them all. Oops. And copy them. There we go. And 
lift them off a bit. Whee! Not that much. Like so, lift them up again. And do they all copy? That's unfortunate. I don't really want them to copy. So instead, let's uh, let's unselect them all and just copy those four. Lift them up. There we go. And then we won't have the same ones underneath. Yeah, that's better. Okay, and unfortunately they they raise up a little, but something we're going to have to deal with, I think. Um, contains stack containers, generic industries. What do these ones look like? Are you already is it you like two together already? Are you? Yes, you are. Okay, that's cool. So let's start working on this side for some as well. I can that. That's neat. Okay, we're going to let them off the fact that they're floating. Because it's not something we're really going to be able to do anything about. Okay, let's... Uh, let's place some down for a little while. There we go. And then we'll do some of these smaller ones. I quite like these as well. Um, there we go. These would probably be placed down a little bit neater in real life. Actually, I don't know. Would they? Not sure. Like so. Okay, that's neat. All right, let's um, let's move it on a few of these then. There we go. Copy them. Lift them up. We not quite that much. Oh, really not that much. Okay. Uh, take them away. Let's try that again. We can move it. Uh, do them. We're missing one there. We'll put that back in again in a second. Is there a way to see it go past? I kind of guess it's just when that shape stops, isn't it? Yeah. So it seems to be about there. Yeah, that's better. Okay, and then we just need to copy one of them across to there. Cool. Okay, so that's give us some thingies around. And, um, you know, I could probably spend a lot longer doing some more of these, but I kind of just want to move on to something else today. So uh, let's get some big decals on the go. Uh, there are some cool ones for, like... Um, Road markings, uh, the cracks. Well, cracks are pretty cool as well, actually. Let's get some of them in. Um, yeah, let's get some cracks in. Cause we want this place to look a bit old, but, you know, used, worn in, I guess. Uh, there we go. Uh, big one. Oh, yeah, that's ace. Well, I guess if we do this, we've kind of got to do one of them. We've kind of got to do them all over. Um, I think they work quite nicely though actually. Let's maybe do it off the track like that. Yeah, that looks neat. Maybe not all the way, but every now and again we'll have one of those. They look really good. Uh, one of these has a couple of the other side as well. Okay, and there. Cool. Right, puddles, I'm mean, really, yeah, puddles, are, you know, they would be a thing, especially like around these, uh, around these tanks, you know, they could be, they dribble, dribbly tanks, you know how it is with your dribbly tanks. Oh, you're neat, you, you, you actually follow the line of the, uh, of them, that's cool. Oh, they're really shiny as well, ah, that's amazing. I love the bits in this that you can get to add things on. Skid marks, yeah, I think, although, probably not the circular one, but. Let's try and put the circular one under there so it looks like people are always turning in to it. Uh, and what have we got over here? Yeah, you're a bit more of a generic one, that's good. Especially here where the uh, where there would be a lot of turning and you know stuff like that. Um, what are you? Oh, rock decals. So we don't want anything like this. Uh, no, nothing like this just now. Uh, although actually, yeah, some some sort of markings would actually be pretty neat to sort of say you know not not in this area type thing 
that. Oh, careful. Okay, cool. They're probably better done with the line tool, but never mind. Um, some slight, finer cracks, just where a couple of these have gone down a bit too heavy. You know, they look pretty cool. Where some of these have got, oh, you've got a bit of a floaty, uh, floaty thing there. What else we got? Some asphalt that's just been covered up. Places where there's been a bit of a uh, bit of repair work being done. You know, this stuff happens a lot. Uh, farm fields, truck oil. Oh, look at this one. Truck oil leak. Um, the being four in a row is a bit weird, though. Let's put it. I guess where the trucks park up. So, uh Oh, that's cool. School key clear. We should go and add that onto it. What's that one? Steel road plates. Hmm. Uh, loading zone. Yeah, that's good. We'll get some loading zones in. There'll be one there where that fill that thing fills up, whatever it is. Um, and over here, they, these are all loading zones. But those two are the ones that are only showing up and then keep clear along here. Cool. Uh, manicure grass, rock, no, they're a little bit too heavy. You know, it's a bit of rubbish. Yeah, why not? Uh, just randomly putting stuff down. The ones I was looking for are actually the ones where it just looks like there's somebody coming into the into the turn. It's just like a generic, um, whoops, like a generic path. Uh, Actually, you'll, you'll know what I mean when I show you. Uh, those? No. Ah, yeah, here. Road wear. These ones here. So it looks this like this is just where people come in a lot. So here. Uh, and where's the, where are we going to have the other entrance? Over here. Yeah, so you need to have this kind of thing as well. Thanks for listening. And your home crane rail. Oh, you're neat. We should have your. We should have the crane on a crane rail. Although we've only got really quite big cranes. Never mind. Uh, numbers. That's neat. Big cargo. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at this. That makes sense to have something like that. I guess. Drains all over. There would be. That did a very good job. And flowers we don't need. Ah, the right. These are the ones I was actually looking for. These sort of specific ones. That's okay. We can have them come round. Uh, shows where people turn in a lot. And actually, onto the road as well would make sense, wouldn't it? Like that. Well, it's really subtle. We know they're there, don't we? We'll know. Uh, and the last thing I want to do then is uh, is turn all these on. And put some fence around the whole area. Spelling it right. I mean, it's fair the stuff anyway, but we actually want like a really high industrial fence. Let's have a look. Is it going to be that one? Yeah, that's the one we want. We want this to be a really, like, you ain't getting in here unless you're meant to be in here, sort of thing, you know? Um, I'm really annoyed that you have to turn this on every time. There we go. And fence mode. Here we go. Beautiful. Uh, so all of this. It's going to be fenced off now, although people actually are parking in there. I don't really mind that much. Um, there we go. And it's going to carry on down here from this entrance area all the way down to... Hmm, let's go to like roughly the edge of this, uh, this area. And we'll do some tree work to finish it off. And here, oh perfect, down to the path and then kind of have to follow the path on this very slight curve that it's ended up on, like that, that's good, and then we'll bring it back just a little for the bus stop, um, to here, yeah, in fact that'll do actually because that area kind of needs to be a bit open. Uh, Okay, cool. 
good stuff. And now uh, we did say that we would have this area here as um, as an entrance. There we go. So let's put out where's these cool gates. The other one. Well, yeah, you're not the you're not the same as either side though. Where's that? I like that one. Uh, let's try gate. Yeah, there it is. I really like that one. I think it fits nicely. I mean, it doesn't quite fit, but never mind. Um, the, and these as well. These are definitely the sort of thing you would have, you know, to check people coming in and out. In fact, it would most likely be... Well, no, it would be something more like that, wouldn't it? Even though that's a bit wrong sizing-wise. I still think it would be something like this. And we'll do that on the other side as well. Um, they're pretty much the same either way, but never mind. Put them down. And good. And then the last thing I'm going to start looking for is a few trucks that we can just place down that make it look this place look a little bit more used, you know. Um, so we can... Oh, yeah, trailers, look. Oh, you're a neat one. Let's have you over here, I think. In fact, this could be... We could do like a little parking area, actually. Where would that be? Let's have a look at the area bigger yeah I think down here drive around the pallets to be the parking area so let's have a few here um, there we go a few of these few few British few English few uh, American star ones why not let's just get whoa not that one that's ridiculous uh, you there will have some oil leaks underneath you and oil leaks here where the other ones park up around a regular occasion um, Let's have another one of you. I quite like you. There we go. So there's all the random trucks parked up, ready for work. And um, do you know what? I just want a few more decals, just where it's... Um, oops. Just where it's a bit more empty. Let's get some of those uh, roughage-type roughage ones. What are these? Oh, you're a bit too intense. Destroyed road. Oh, you're pretty good. You're just a bit square, you know? That's kind of the only problem with them. Um, no, no. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. And then these ones are a bit too... Into, yeah, it wouldn't be cobble underneath there. That would be concrete all the way down. Um, so really, it doesn't help us. Road damage. Yeah, so that's pretty good. Maybe up against the fence. You know? Maybe a bit on the uh, on the track there. Just wanted some of the uh, yeah road wear where they all turn in. And it starts to spread out to where they park here. Just where there's like daily daily parking from the cars. There we go. Just makes it a little bit more uh, more believable. Um. See so these ones there. These are the ones that are just a bit just too over the top, aren't they? Just a bit too uh, too dark. Uh, yeah, general stains. General stains. Uh, I'll give you some down. What else we got? I'd, you know what? The skid marks and the puddles seem to be the ones that really, really sort of make the zone pop. I don't put too many puddles down. Uh, on your farm. Uh, I don't know what any of you are. Tire marks, road damage. Yeah, again, they're just it's just the fact that they're so square, you know. Mud. Oh, I don't mind some of the mud. Yeah, that's, oh yeah, there we go. That'll fit nicely there. And what are you? No idea. Just Wet general wetness <laughs> stains. It's just yeah, it's just this sort of thing that just really breaks up uh, breaks up the very flat pavement, you know. I think it actually looks pretty neat when it's done. Um, just like general general roughage. Uh, oh yeah, talking of which, these need to go. Didn't notice that they were there to be honest. Uh, is there any others? No. Yeah, so stains wise you should all be just sort of helping out there. Uh 
skid marks we have a few of already big cracks broken glass that's quite neat um just to kind of break up the uh the sort of very gray over over area i want a few more trucks parked down here don't i yes i do um let's do a not one open but let's have yeah i love these these truck stains that's the sort of little details that really sort of make it pop i think so we'll just have a few on this side not as many we'll go for the uh smaller ones you're not quite parts as much as your mate was uh, there we go yeah good he's abandoned it what are you you're a fire engine yeah we don't need you what are you oh landfill yeah we just definitely don't want you cool uh, right, I think that's looking pretty neat. Um, I'll probably put some more cargo in, but you know, it's quite boring to watch to be fair, so maybe I'll do that off camera, but I'm kind of happy with that. I think I'm going to leave it there. Very slightly shorter episode than we normally would, I guess. Um, you know, it's still doing some damage to the trees around here. Maybe this whole area can end up being, uh, you know, sort of industrial in the end to stop this horrible fallout stuff that we get. Talking of which, what's it doing over here? Oh, look! We're all back to normal. That's great. Uh, okay, cool. Right, so thank you so much for watching. Is the fire out? Yes, it is. Again, hopefully that'll take a little while and get back to normal as well. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really does help out the channel. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, or suggestions, pop them down in the comments. And if you fancy a chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at Chanty Sparrow. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.